please be sure to subscribe to the channel to update the fastest and most accurate news. Hello everyone, welcome back to my journalism of the hard news channel. The story for today is the cast of Married at First Sight finally regained access to their social media channels this week, after Channel 9 took control for the duration of the show. But on Thursday, Yahoo Lifestyle reported that the network has given a stark warning to the cast about how they should be using their platform. The publication claims that the stars have been advised to move on from the show and focus on their own futures, rather than reignite feuds with co-stars. A source said, since the finale aired, the cast has essentially divided in two, with each side leaking stories and taking swipes at the other in the media to try and come out on top. It's all become very childish, and Channel 9 worry that now they've all got their accounts back they'll use them to stir drama and try to tear each other down even more. The cast have essentially been told to just move on and focus on their future instead. Daily Mail Australia has reached out to Channel 9 for further comment. As of Wednesday, the brides and grooms all have access to their Instagram accounts again and are free to post whatever they like without approval from Nine's social media team. During the show's run, Nine had final say on all their Instagram activity, including the wording of captions and the ability to respond to direct messages. We are very proactive in this space, and care for the health and well-being of the participants, the network said was the reasoning behind the move at the time. As a result of the level of interest in the participants' personal lives and volume of commentary on every post, Nine manages all individual MAFS social accounts with their permission, as an extra measure of protecting them from negativity. One cast member who couldn't resist taking a swipe at his ex was Brent Vidyalo, who was married to Tamara Georgievic on the show. After gaining access to his account this week, he changed his Instagram bio to good luck, good riddance. Viewers might remember the powerful words were the last thing Brett said to Tamara at final vows, shortly after calling her vindictive, spiteful and self-absorbed. Brent uttered the words right before he tossed his speech in the air and stormed off set, leaving Tamara staring ahead in shock. That is all for today news, please make sure to leave your comment and subscribe the channel below for more news update. Thank you for watching.